Hello, hello, it's Maria. I'm a reporter here with WDW Magazine here to take you on another magical escape. While it may look like I'm coming to you today from inside the Beast Castle, I am in fact at the Advent Health Arena where I am previewing the 2023 Run Disney Wine and Dine Half Marathon Weekend merchandise. There are tons of different merchandise pieces here to explore, including the core collection, and we are getting a preview of a brand new Disney line you're going to be seeing pop up in the theme parks very soon. So without further ado, let's check out all of the Run Disney merchandise. All runners running during the Wine and Dine Half Marathon weekend are required to come in person to pick up their race bib at the Advent Health Arena here at ESPN Wide World of Sports. And what you're looking at is the entranceway. There are tons of awesome themed photo opportunities, a red carpet rolled out for the runners to enter and walk upon, and a full garden set up here themed to Alice in Wonderland. So what a welcoming way to be brought into the merchandise section here before you run for the weekend. I love these huge numbers here representing the different race lengths. They're perfect for a photo op. So when you come to pick up your race number and check out the merchandise area, do not miss posing with these gigantic numbers for whatever race you're running. Speaking of photo ops here at the expo, they also have beautiful backdrops representative of the three films that are represented over the course of the 5K, 10K and half marathon. And they are Encanto, Beauty and the Beast and Alice in Wonderland. Here is a look at the Run Disney core merchandise line. Now the core merchandise line is available for all of the Run Disney races. It is not race or theme specific and all of the merchandise like this hat, the jacket we just saw, the matching sweatpants here with little Mickey running down the side. There it is from the front. They are all going to be in this same blue hued color scheme. All of the core merchandise line is meant to kind of pair with each other, whether it be the zip up, the hat or the pants. And all of that is fully stocked and available here at the race expo. If you want to take that core collection off the athletic training field and into more everyday life, they do have a lounge fly that goes with it. Again, that same really cool tie dye dark light blue logo there with Mickey running as fast as he can across the front there and the lounge fly logo on the zipper. I'm here with Morgan. She is on the marketing team with Run Disney. And Morgan, my question for you is, how do all of these different Disney characters from these different movies that are represented here as part of the Run Disney races kind of tie into the merchandise and tie into that marketing element? Absolutely. So here at Run Disney, when we are coming up with what the themes will be for each of these individual races, we really are looking about two years in advance. Wow. So when we're putting all this together, it is not just marketing working on this. We also have merchandise, our merchandise team. We have franchise, entertainment, our business development team, a whole host of cross-functional people working together, trying to come up with what the best idea for each individual race theme could be, including the characters that are represented. While a lot goes into that, specifically thinking about wine and dine, this whole idea is around a banquet bash. I'm a runner myself, and I know something that I really love is the idea of food. Mm. And a lot of memories are made for me around the table, whether it's after a long run, sitting with my friends around a big table, drinking coffee, having our breakfast after our big morning food is really integral to my running process we need fuel to move and it's about the memories that you make with your fellow runners as well so this whole idea of wine and dine is around these major food scenes as in our most beloved Disney stories so how do we tie all those things together it's about running and then food and all the things that bring us all together around the table as we serve up courses to you at wine and dine Awesome. Thank you, Morgan. Of course. Here we go on to the race specific merchandise. This is of course the wine and dine 2023 weekend coming up right now. And let's start off with, we can't talk about them, but we can show them on camera. The Bruno theme merchandise, 13.1 miles. This is obviously the half marathon theme stuff. Really, really cute Bruno on there. Looking just like he does in the film of Encanto. We've got another decal here. Perfect for your car or your refrigerator to celebrate that you did it. Look at these, so cute. Little pins there, they've got the little ribbon that's like at the metal there, which I really like. Another celebration pin with Mirabelle on it there. And then this is probably my favorite one. <laughs> Running is in your future. Thank you, Bruno. And that one's positioned right here next to the Encanto ears. I know lots of Disney fans who frequent Walt Disney World often grab an ornament as a souvenir for their vacation. Check this one out. It is the 2023 Wine and Dine Half Marathon Weekend Sneaker. 
It's got all of the characters on it. It's got the little ribbon there so you can hang it on your tree. And look at the sole. It says wine and dine on the bottom with the little logo there. That is absolutely adorable and a great way to commemorate your race this year on your Christmas tree. I'm going to use my brand new friend, the mannequin here to show off a couple items. Here is the wine and dine half marathon hat with the, also the little 2023 year there on the brim. Really nice bright blue color. There is the jacket, the wine and dine 2023 jacket. You can see it there being worn. Again, nice performance material when you get up close to that. It's nice and thin, nice and windbreaker materially. I love it. I also really like this lug. Oftentimes these over the shoulder slings can be really large and almost cumbersome. This one's very sleek. It just fits the bottle. It's of course got the logo on it and all of the different characters in addition to that Disney Parks logo there. Nice vivid bright colors here with plenty of zippers for storage. The performance athletic material shirt here in that same nice slate gray mirrors the jacket in the 2023 Wine and Dine Half Marathon logo there on the breast as well as the big logo across the back featuring all of the different characters and of course Epcot. This shirt has all of the races represented on it. It is a shirt that is represented of the spirit jersey for this weekend's races. Again, all of the characters and the races represented here on the back. And what I really like about this one is actually two things. I love this yellow color because it is not a very, very bright yellow that's going to clash. It's really, really a nice warm yellow. And the second thing that I love about it are all of the little character specific elements that are kind of flying off here as they run by. I think that's a really nice attention to detail bit here. And we've got one more corksicle here to look at in the full size with that pop top. Again, all of the races represented there, but check out the back. They've got the different patterns that represent Alice in Wonderland, Beauty and the Beast, and Encanto. The three movies that these races are themed after this weekend. I really like that detail on the back there. Of course, it's a corksicle. Run Disney never forgets us pass holders. Here is the 2023 Wine and Dine Half Marathon Weekend Pass Holder Exclusive Collection. Check out the shimmer in this spear jersey catching the light there. Run Disney 2023 on the front with the Madrigal sisters on the back. That's really, really nice. And this has kind of got a little bit of a, a 3D almost bubble print texture up here. Definitely makes it pop a lot. We've got a pass holder, again, exclusive wine and dine shirt here. Another great one for training or wearing on a really hot day to a theme park because it is that performance tech material. Here is a look at the back of that one down here. Check this out, perfectly tied into what Morgan just told us about this race weekend's theming around food. Check out the wine glasses. What I really like about them is not only do they have the character elements there represented, they also have the four theme park logos represented there as well. We've got some phone cases here. Two styles look like they might fit a variety of different phones. I really like it if you can look at the one that has Louisa there, where it says wine and dine versus where kind of she's standing flexing her muscles. It's almost a 3D pattern there. The wine and dine is set behind her. So it gives it a really, really cool 3D look. That's of course the pass holder one. We've got the one to the left representing all of the races, the challenge phone case with Figment on it there. And here at the bottom, we have the individual 10K half marathon and the 5k finisher phone cases and we've got some magnets here too interspersed around to celebrate and commemorate the different length races that you are participating in this weekend the corksicle wine tumbler has got that blue and nice bright yellow on it here are all the characters mirabelle figment there is the wine and dine logo there on the front we've got alice and cogsworth there and of course the corksicle logo on the side really nice nice and shiny corksicle here not one of those matte ones it's nice and bright and shiny continue to explore the merchandise preview tune in from a word from my friends over at wdw magazine subscribe to wdw magazine and escape to walt disney world every single month this large format glossy magazine is filled with content not ads subscribe now and don't miss another month of magic i am here with km with run disney cam i'm gonna ask you a couple questions my first one is how far in advance do you and your team start planning for these different race weekends when it comes to the merchandise? That's a really good question. We actually start between 18 and 24 months before the race actually happens. Wow. That's because we have to have the right amount of time to be able to think about what the themes will be, which are the characters that would be best associated with those themes, how do we ensure that we're telling their stories, who their relationships are with, what their struggles and accomplishments are, and how that relates to the Run Disney Race Weekends, and then how do we incorporate all of those seamlessly together. 
So this year's core collection we got to preview today, which looks absolutely beautiful. What is new about this year's core collection, if anything, that you can share? Sure, so one of the things that you'll see this year is a new brand for us in accessories. It's called Lug. And this um, will be the biggest sort of projection of Lug that you'll see in the park so far this year. What's great about Lug is they are designed by a husband and wife team who are park goers. They are avid park goers. So they know the challenges of where do I put my keys and where does my wallet go and what am I gonna do with my phone while you're enjoying the park's experience. This one here is called the Huggy. And for the first time we are introducing this one which has a water bottle holder in it. So you've got all the really great pockets to store your stuff, but this, We've built it so that it works with our Corksicle Canteen, fits beautifully inside this item. Another really great feature with Lug, again, because these are people who are park goers, everything is convertible. So I'm wearing this as a crossbody right now, but you could then shorten the strap and wear it as a shoulder oh. strap, or there's a loop on the back here and you can take the strap off and make it into a waist bag. Oh, that's so awesome. it's really about you utilizing the items to fit what you need them for. That's great, as you're right, that is perfect for a park day. A couple more pieces to the two course challenge collection. There is a figment themed sweatshirt, also very purple in his exact color scheme. And these are really pretty ears. Wine and Dine logo there in the center. They are that leathery material. And again, they've got figment and Alice, the Cheshire cat represented on them. Here's some more of that new Disney lug partnership material merchandise here. Wine and Dine half marathon weekend there. And now after Cam showed us, this one can transition from a crossbody bag to a fanny pack. You can just slide the straps through there and have it be transitioned. I love that. Here's a tank top. We've got all the characters represented. I love that all the different characters are on the same shirt. I really like that representation of all the different movies. If you're just a Disney fan, it's a great way to show your fandom representing multiple. And here are some athletic running pants. Key component for me is having this phone side pocket here, but these are three quarter length running pants. And look at that side stripe with all of the different theme parks represented on it. The little teapots and the elements from this year's race. Really, really nice piece there. Here's some more of that Disney run Disney lug partnership that you're going to be seeing popping up in the theme parks. This is a cool exclusive opportunity to preview that run Disney logo there on that one. And here is a bag that is specific to this half marathon weekend. What I really like about these, like my friend here is just saying, you can tell someone who goes to the theme parks design these. Cause I just came up and I was able to touch it. And if it's raining, there's no way this bag's gonna get wet. The water's gonna roll right off of it. And if you are a frequenter of the Walt Disney World theme parks, you do know that it can sometimes rain. Plus check out all of these front pockets, zipper pockets, big pocket down there, tons of pockets inside, separate pouch for a laptop. There's just so much storage for you to store things in little nooks and crannies that really come in handy here for the park use, but also just in their design. They're really fun to also carry around and use. And that is going to do it for me here today at the Run Disney Merchandise Preview. Thank you so much for checking out the video. Leave a comment, let us know what your favorite piece is. And if you are running this weekend's races, drop us a comment and let us know what distances you're participating in. We would love to know. Good luck this weekend to all of the runners and I will see you in the next Magical Escape.